truth is, is that the Lord loves everybody. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's one of the deepest, you know what I'm saying, uh, 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 delusions that they abundant. Everybody can be saved. That everybody can be saved. That's because that's what the so-called white man teach you, man. That's why the scriptures say that no effeminate can enter into the kingdom of heaven. Right. Uh, uh, effeminate is a non-believer, man. And also a feminine nigga, man, who get into his emotions, get his goddamn feelings. You know what I'm saying? Instead of believing what the word say. A lot of you goddamn people are getting into your goddamn feelings. I'm talking about you men of Israel. Women, they supposed to get in their goddamn feelings. That's, that's, that's where that pride comes from. Yeah. This yeah. recording right now. Yeah. Of course. I don't want to put you guys on the spot. You can. We already on the spot. All right. Yo, everybody's got one thing in common in, in this world. Our feelings are hurt. So you guys. Everybody feelings not hurt, Chad. David Rothschild feelings ain't hurt. No, they, David, they, 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 they're the ones they who rule in the world right now. They're the ones who rule in the But they're going to get their feelings hurt. They're going to be good. They're going to be right, right, foot. Right. Hey, we're going to put our foot on their goddamn neck like that. All right, so your feelings are hurt because you know that your brothers and sisters. Please ask you 7 and 7. Wait. It hurts your feelings. So you're trying to, no, you're yeah, trying yeah, to yeah, get yeah, the yeah, word man, to them. Listen, now, I'm not fucking hurt. All right. They're my brothers and sisters. But we you know what I'm saying? They're not waking up. Because I'm out here preaching for the, for my real brothers, the elect. The elect. Let's clear that up. But go right. ahead. All right, get your get your point out, Chad. Here, when you call to the people and you're yeah. trying to tell them, but it's triggering anger from you. Right. If you're angry, and it's making you somebody use get a clean. He got it. Seven, All right. Seven. So like, Chad, you you are. Yeah, it's making him yeah. use the Lord's name in vain. Who? Who knows using if the name? You say, "Gee, damn." Do you consider that using the Lord's name in vain as you? Hey, you know what? Goddamn me. No. That means uh, that the Lord is damning you, man. It, it's uh, all right. Okay, so if you're using it, but it just sounds like to me, I was raised where if I use you was raised. God, you know, gee, damn. If I use God's name and damn in the same. God's name, not God. No, but, 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 yes, but, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, Chad, what's your name, Chad? Right? Yes. Don't the Lord condemn? He does. That's what that is. When you say God damn, that's condemning the wicked. That's the proper understanding. That's the proper understanding. So it's not for you. It's not you. You know what? You say? Doctrine. Teaching false doctrine in the name of your how about shimmy our shot because we got guys out here that's doing that man. It hurts my that you you you, you teach the oh now you in your feelings doctrine. The feelings and emotions that's, are the wrong things to go off with. Right, right. So you go off the, the Bible. Right. The that Bible. Right. Not. Yes. That's good to know. Yes. I hear a lot of people saying that, and I always try to correct them and say, oh, if you can choose any other swear word but that. Just to throw the Lord's name in vain when they're not oh, preaching the word. Swear. Listen, 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 Tad. What does swear mean? What, I got, what do I got swear mean? I got preset. We're not swearing on nothing. Stop them, Sha. Go ahead, brother. Leviticus chapter 19, verse 12. Right. It says, And ye shall not swear by my name falsely. Say, see, see, see. So swearing is not against the Bible. But get the scripture where it says you shall swear. There's a scripture in the Bible that says you shall swear. Type in swear. Because swear meaning you, you swear meaning you binding yourself to an oath. We swore to the Lord by, by preaching this truth. We're binded by an oath to preach this truth. So when you uh, when you you get a Bible dictionary and look up the word curse or swear, it's you got a Western definition and you have the definition. The definition you understand. So like you, it's on Chad. Okay. The definition that you understand swearing and cursing by is by the Western definition, which yep. is what? The American definition. But if you pick up your phone and you went to Google right now and you type in curse, you know what you know what it's gonna say? If it's you a, type in curse, it on, means to wish ill on somebody. Exactly. It's, it's, it means to wish ill will or harm. Or harm on somebody. That's what that's what curse means. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, but, but as far as no, like just swearing, type in swear. It's in it's in you know, it's, 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 it's like, you know what I'm saying? Like taking a oath. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's what that means, taking a oath. Like, they don't mean like like when you say home. bitch or shit, that's not swearing. Yeah. You know, you gotta understand the word the meaning of words. You know what I'm saying? Because I know your words. You hear me, you hear me up in the, you know what I'm saying, you know, in the spirit, you know, cursing my people out. Well, but that's what our Lord told us to do. Look, hey, what's your nationality? Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Now, Chad, you was talking about you know, emotions and feelings. Now, the whole point of the truth is edification, so you can build someone up, so they can understand, right? But feelings and emotions comes into play when you block the edification off. Well, I don't agree with that, and that's wrong, and y'all don't know what the fuck y'all talking about. That's how they get emotional. But if you allow, okay, you say this is true, prove it. 
and then we go in the scriptures and you prove yes. it, then you're okay. I accept that you're not getting in your court. That's where emotions and feelings come into play. <laughs> but you, right? and that's the problem though, you see, because a lot of our people, they're gonna get caught up in their emotions. And their right. Yeah. Yes. You see what I'm saying? That's why I ask you, what's your nationality? Well, he, he when I first met you guys, yeah. you like French or some shit. Said, right. And you guys said, well, all right, no white man is going to sit here and listen to this for this long. And you guys thought that I might have been or had Israeli descent. Is Israelite. Israelite descent. Thank you. Right, right, right. So I went and got a DNA test done. Uh, through ancestry DNA. Get, 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 Romans, the Romans 8 and 16. That's all, look, 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 look. All right, so like it, let's let finish, so like it. So it went way back, my heritage went way back, and I do have fourth cousins that are of African descent. So I don't know what that means, but I don't have any roots to Israel. Like my family, it goes to the 1700s, and my family, as of 1700, wasn't in Israel. But my family was from Great Britain and from a lot of parts of all over Europe and Asia Minor and different places. But I do have a fourth cousin <laughs> that is black. So uh, check. Uh, what does that mean? Uh, I don't wait, know. Wait, wait, you oh, said wait, you got family all through you Asia want? Minor? Romans 8 and 16. Oh, okay. Hey, grab okay. that Romans 8 and 16. Because, Chad, what you got to understand is yeah. Israel was, it's, it's not a, what you're doing, you're going about the carnal, physical way that the powers that be said you must trace your ancestry. Listen, listen, look, look at it, look at me. Look at the guys around you. Do you think we can trace our ancestry back to Israel? Really? That that is the that is a that is a physical carnal aspect that the Lord is not dealing with because do you know that uh they have been exposed that ancestry.com and those people that's tracing their lineage, it's been it's been um exposed that uh that that's not true. All you gotta do is go go type in ancestry.com exposed. That's just a way for them people to get money. Now when you now all things must be done according to the Bible. Now, Romans, listen to this. Romans 8 and 16, you got it, brother? Romans chapter 8, verse 16. This is how we, this is how you are, you got to be spiritual. And what is the spirit? John 6 and 63. The words that I speak, they are spirit and they are life. So this Bible, that's first and foremost. If you're looking up something and it don't back up the Bible, that's how you can know it's false. If it backs up the Bible, then hey, I'm, I'm going to look further into it. But if it does not agree with the Bible, Chad, it's false. Now, now check this out. This is what this is what brought, brought us in. Romans chapter 8, verse 16. The Spirit itself bear witness. The Spirit itself. What is the Spirit? I quoted it, John 60, 63. This Bible, the words that I speak, the Spirit itself. Go ahead. The Spirit itself bear witness with our spirit. So the bear witness, it agree with our spirit. The spirit that the Lord put in us, we, we're drawing to the truth of this. Right. Go. And what, hold on, Shalaki, if I may add, what did the Lord say? He said that now I shall now draw all men into me. You see what I'm saying? And, how, and the reason why he said that is why? Because he became the sacrificial lamb for his people. And now you got to go through him. That's part of that too. But go ahead, brother. Mm -hmm. It says, uh, the spirit itself bear witness with our spirit. So the, so the Bible bear witness with the spirit within us that what? That we are children of Yahweh. Yes, that, that, we are, that we are the sons of the living God. Right. Because it's no matter what you can do, you cannot run away from, from the truth of this Bible. So it's, so like Chad, we already told you, we got Israelites, there's Israelites amongst us that look exactly like you. Right. Now, he look like Natsuzakia. He do. He look exactly, uh, or, or the other brother that's in uh, Virginia. Oh, uh, it's uh, men of valor. Yeah. Because yeah, it's, uh, it's not about skin color. You can go and you can look. It's people as dark as us. That's not Israelite. That's it's right. not about color. Barack Obama. Barack Obama, Obama is not an Israelite. He's a Hemite. It don't matter yeah, about yeah, Africans. Nelson we, Mandela. We Nelson Mandela. Mandela. Well, guess what? I tell you who is an Israelite yeah. though. Uh, 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 Leonardo DiCaprio. Leonardo DiCaprio, Israelite. Uh, 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 what was it? Justin Timberlake. Justin Timberlake, Justin the Israelite. Uh, 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 what's her name? Uh, Brad, uh, Angelina Jolie. Brad Pitt. Angelina Brad Pitt. Jolie. John Voight. Uh, uh, Cameron Diaz. These are all Israelites, but guess what? They look just like white people. Right. But they're Israelites. They're into the Illuminati right Well, they're in the loop, but they, but they're still Israelites. They're still the bloodline. They're still, like, they're not Israelite according to the spiritual circumstances. No, not every Israelite. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, not every Israelite righteous. Right. Excellent point. But they still point. Israelites by blood. Yeah. Some. By 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 uh, race and creed, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they Israelite. Right, Father Bashar, let me go ahead, bro. Let me let me get this right quick. This is uh, Amos chapter nine, verse nine. Now, before I read this, let me ask you something. If I'm sifting, if I had, if I if I have corn, if I have pure corn, and I drop it in dirt, and I pick, and I, am I gonna be able to pick that all, every single corn up? 
I mean, let me, let, me, let me rephrase that. If I drop some corn and some dirt, and I scoop it up, and I'm sifting through it, uh, 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 what am I? What is all the? Uh, what is all the dirt falling? Am, am I? Uh, am I gonna grab that dirt up and put it back in my corn, even though I just sifted through it? Or am I just gonna click up the dirt, sift through it, and just grab my corn that I accidentally dropped? Yeah, well, if you just wanted the corn, uh -huh. you'd probably leave the dirt and take. Right, you're gonna leave the dirt right there. You're not gonna want the dirt, right? So you sift it. You, you, you sift it. Right? Somebody get that real quick. And Matthews, you got it. No, I got angels. This is it's Amos chapter 9, verse 9. It says, For lo, I command, I command, I will sift the house of Israel among all nations. He's going to sift them. So if I'm sifting something, that means what? I'm trying to separate something. I'm trying right. to separate two different things. Now, if I'm doing that with everybody, that means even in those, even in all these nations, Bubba Kishore, give me that again. If this is my corn, if number one is my corn, but I've got, I have a sifter at the bottom, I'm going through all of these, guess what? That number one is sifted through every single one of them. Right. Because I can't, because it also uh, mentions in the scriptures that not one least grain shall fall from the Lord's hand. Right. So not, there's not gonna be not one is right that's gonna perish with these other nations right here. Right. So this number one, Israel, is through every single one of these 18 tribes. Right. So I gotta go through all of them in order to come back to my pure, my pure seed, which is the corn, right? right? So why did the Lord have to do that? Because there's certain Israelites within those. Right. Know? That's why. Because then guess what? You think you think I'm going to be born a Chinese, both my parents are Chinese, but oh, since I'm in Israel, I'm going to be born like this? No, I'm going to be looking like Bruce Lee. Right. Or, or Jackie Chan or somebody. You know? This is why This is why he's saying it. This is uh, Leviticus chapter, chapter 26. 26, 30, 26 and 32. It says, and I will bring and I will bring the land into desolation, which is Israel, and your enemies which dwell therein shall be astonished at it. And, and again, that, that enemies that's full. You know what I'm saying? That's not talking about just the uh, enti the spiritual entity Satan. That's what I'm talking about the heathens. Because, you know, no, because Israel is the You know what I'm talking about Satan. Yeah. So you got to point that out. Yeah, but at, at the time this is written, it's Leviticus. It's talking about the heathens. Yeah. It says, and I will scatter you among the heathen, which is everybody that's not an Israelite. It says, so you got to understand, Chad, our people are scattered amongst these people. And the way you, the way you can tell our people from amongst those people is that our people have an affinity towards the Bible. And also our people was blessed with being stronger than everyone else. Smarter. When you read John, smarter. Well, we have more aptitude than people. Stand it out. We stand out. We 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 have abilities that other other nations don't have. Right. The Lord said that ye are the salt of the world. We are. Yeah. Yeah. We just we the salt. We we are the yeah. salt is and, what flavor. That's right. And so not, we give this place flavor. So like y'all. No no no. I don't want to cut you off, brother. Not, not saying that the other nations can't do it. It's just not as good. Just not as good as what we can do it. You might be able to dribble basketball, shoot it. You might be able to uh, cross people up. But guess what? I might be able to cross you over, step back, add some flavor, shoot it, and walk off looking at you in your eye. He can't do that. See? Because why? He is an Israelite. He just, it's like flavors to him. He right. just know how to do it because it's just, it's, it's, it's hey, just hey, in him. And the scriptures say that Jacob is the form of all things. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because Jacob what? He created a stoplight. You know who created Do you know who created the stoplight? And he he also created the yeah. gas mask too. His name is Gary Moore, Morgan. You know, when you look at everything in this earth, yeah. it, it goes back to a so-called, not so-called, it goes back to an Israelite. Yeah. Whether it's been a so-called black man, a so-called uh, uh, Mexican, a so-called Native American, or it could be somebody that like you, that roots may went back to our people, but through processes of time, his father laid with heathen women and his children look like heathens, but it's about the seed line. We read to you Numbers 1 and 18 last time you were here that they declared the pedigrees by the house of their father. What is the pedigree? It's your genealogy. So your genealogy is determined by the house of your father. It's not a coincidence that you grow a beard. The Romans and the Greeks and the so-called white man, that is not their custom. It's not a coincidence that you have, you, you, you're so connected with the Bible like this. Yeah. You got some people that's connected with the Bible and once they hear this truth, it's all, oh, I, I, I can't deal with it. But you have heard the truth and you, you, you've wrestled and battled with it in your mind. 
Right. Since I came back today, because I've been studying some of what you guys said, I uh, went to the Church of Israel in Gary on West 25th. They said I could become a parishioner there, or however they would call that. And right. You said I'm you hunting. Went to right Church of Israel. Well, well, that's what his father. His do you know his, his father and one of our elders? They you they used to go there. All the elders went there. They went there. Yeah, they still had a small group there, but uh, they were good. They welcomed me in. They said I could become a part of the church. Yeah, but, you know, they, they, but guess what? They're going on because they're going by the skin because they think you're a so-called white man, which so-called white man, which is Edom, they can't be redeemed. They get get, be get the, uh, they're, they're going off your skin color. So all what we just said, Bible they're shot. not going off that. They're going off because you, because you look like a white man. They're like, oh, this is a white man. He can be good. So guess what? If um, David Rockefeller, which we know is in this country, uh, like, Devil! He knows he the mic. Definitely he the mic. They would have said he okay, he can come in there. Which if David Rockefeller came up in, we'd tell him no, you're going into slavery, get away from us. All right, so they're going off basically. Yo, uh, yo. Plus, up there, it's just, that's just one incident. Oh no, West 25th accepted me. They were great. Of course they did. They accepted. They didn't like the fact that I smoked cigarettes, and I know, but I also, you know, noticed that they were very gluttonous, eating a lot of cheeseburgers at lunch. So I didn't want to point that out. And be like, well, you're gluttonous. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm smoking, we're both sinners. I'm like, you're eating pounds and pounds of burgers for lunch. I'm eating nothing, nuts and berries. So I said, I'm eating the word of God. I'm not eating all that food. But I didn't say that because I didn't want to well, do that. But um, yeah, so I've been studying a lot, trying to find out. Okay, I read a lot of scripture about how the fall. Okay, if, if the Adam and Eve were of black descent and everything started darker and becomes naturally lighter no na oh, wait, wait, not, not, lighter is not natural because well, okay right sorry. right from the fallen angels okay no uh, oh, wait, so, so, so like so like so like so like so like, so like <laughs> chad we gonna start simple for a second because you're going into something we're gonna deal with it but let's let's start simple real quick because you're going to the i know you're going you're going to the fallen angels having sex with the humans yeah. that's just hold on we're gonna deal, we're gonna deal with that. Hold on. They said they said that Noah was born when he came out the womb. His eyes was glowing. He was white. He was talking and all of that. Now this is why this is why the Book of Enoch is fucked because it doesn't add up to the King James version and it does not add up to the Apocrypha. It does not. It does not add up. Now there's things in the King. There's things in the Book of Enoch which speaks about. The angels having sex with humans and all of that. But, uh, get up. Huh? Oh, so like, I, I know you're going, Chad, because I was there too. I, I wanted to know the truth, and I and I got into that. I got into the book of Enoch, I, the, the lost books of the Bible. I got into that. But through the Spirit of the Lord, the Lord led, led me to find out that, wait a minute. Some of these things, the majority of these things does not agree with that King James you got at home. The Apocrypha that they took out of the King James. How do we know that the Apocrypha is, is, is canon, is scripture? Because it agrees with the King James Version. It, there's no discrepancy. There's no contradiction. Right, the, 
you yes. get a 1611 authorized Bible, bro, um, it has it right in there. Right, and it's like precept upon precept. Yep. They all link up together. All I, the precepts link up. I don't know if it's true, but I... We can get it. Get 1 Corinthians. Get that when it says all flesh is, is not of the same flesh. And get that when it says there's one flesh of beast and one... Uh, uh, Corinthians, the glory of... Uh, I think, I want to say 1 Corinthians 10. Because you got to understand when it says... Uh, 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 the fall 